Hi beauties and girls, we are back with another video and in today's video, as you can tell from the title, is that we are going through empties. Yes, let's just say we hit our goal of 250, actually it was 270 after I did all of the empties, but I want to get through 300. What do you think? I know we went through 270 empties, that was including skincare, body care, and hair care, and and makeup in the year of 2017 I am going to come with a beauty inventory type of video and how you can kind of track yourself and make sure that things aren't expiring on you if you want to like save money because we don't want to throw anything out of the door that doesn't deserve it and we want to save our money we want to use what we already have and I feel like project pan 250 was amazing we got to a 270 so i want to do about 300 uh, empties in the year of 2018 i totally think we can hit this goal without further ado let's get through these empties okay so i have my empties in this bag and i think it's going to be designated that this is going to be the bag that we go through and if you have not noticed i will definitely put my empties playlist right over here so you guys can check it out but I want to go ahead and get through these. Basically, I'm going to be showing you guys if I would repurchase it or not. Nah, okay. First thing is the Nivea Enriched Body Lotion with Almond Oil. This is a must-have in my household. Everybody uses this lotion. So this is a keeper. So yes, repurchase. These are the Pacifica like uh this is the whip shave cream would i repurchase these no these were okay they weren't the best i could use shampoo or conditioner or like my body shampoo i could use my body wash to basically um use it as shaving cream i did get this when i was a when i was a contestant of the pacifica muse contest and these are good. They smell good. If you love whipped shaving cream, you can use this. But Body Wash does the same thing. I can save some money. So these are done. Next thing, Kirkland. Y'all know my love obsession with this. This is the Kirkland Daily Facial Toilettes. They're super juicy. I love them. And I still have a box. I bought that like the beginning of last year. I still have them. And uh, yeah, definitely a repurchase. This is the Smooth Naturals All Over Hair and Body Shampoo. Y'all, this is a keeper. This is in Vanilla Woods. This is a scent that actually I like to use. I, I purchased this for my husband, but I actually like almond a lot better. He, I think he likes that scent too. So I wouldn't repurchase the scent, but I will repurchase the item. Another bottle lotion. I told you it's a must have in my family. So I didn't even know I had two bottles, but... The Nivea is the bomb. This is the L'Occitane. This is the Cherry Blossom Body and Shower Gel. I love, uh, this smells really good. It smells more sweet than flower. So yes, I would repurchase this. And yeah, I actually got this in a PR package. But I wanted to try this to see if I really like their body washes. And besides the almond shower oil, this is really good. This one foams up a little bit more. So Yes, I would repurchase that or I would purchase it. I thought I was going to get used through this, but y'all, I don't want this anymore. And this is the Peaches and Clean Deep Cleansing Milk. This would be good for taking off swatches, but I could just use a wipe with this. I feel like that although this is good, it does the job, but I feel like I have to go in and do more work. And I can just use my Purity Made Simple and get it, you know, get it done. So... I am discarding this just because um, I don't like it as much as other things and I'm ready to move on. I kind of got tired of this. So um, yeah, wouldn't repurchase and it was it was okay. This is the Glam Glow Thirsty Clean. I have this in a project pan, but I'm done with this. So I wanted to put it in my empties. I actually need to put it over in my project pan so I can talk about that but I do like that would I repurchase it on sale I, I would say I'm not gonna say no I'm gonna say on sale yes glam glow is expensive so this is the Caudalie serum anti-rides glow activating anti-wrinkle serum that's a long name and yes I really do like this it does have an expiration of six months so with something like this 
when it's such a short span of time this is the only thing i would use and i would repurchase this because i feel like it de definitely gave me a radiant glow and i felt like it did what it said it was going to do so i would repurchase this okay so we're gonna go through these and then we will be done with empties okay so first one i went through this is the makeup forever this is the smoky extravagant i really really like this it has a big brush and I feel like it gave me some really good lashes. But you know what? I love the excessive lash. I fell in love with that so hard. That's like my favorite makeup forever. It's like in my top five of mascaras. And yes, so I wouldn't purchase this one. But yes, the excessive lash. And I have like three of those. This is the Lash Domination. This one's pretty good. But this one is like a double helix type of action going on and this kind of low-key scared me because I kept getting this in my eye so um when it has weird wands and I don't know what to do with it nine times out of ten I'm gonna get it in my eye so I would not repurchase this lash lights camera lashes I love this mascara the tardiest pro mascara has ex like let's see do I have it in here because I am definitely going to talk about the best and worst of my scares. No, I don't have it in here. It's not in here. But this is a good mascara. Okay. The Voluminous Lash Paradise. I felt like I didn't give this one a good enough of a chance. Because everybody loves this. And I was like, why I don't like this? It was because this was in black brown. Usually I get the darkest shade of the bunch and I accidentally got black as brown and I was like maybe it was because it wasn't showing up as much but I do see that this tends to dry out very quickly but I want to give this another shot by getting the the right mascara I felt like that my lashes weren't dark enough and y'all can tell I have like black hair so to get brown, black brown that really didn't do anything for my lashes so I definitely want to give this another shot so those are all of my empties for the month of January and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this and like I said we will be back in the month of February or in the future because sometimes I may skip it may be every other month let me know I'll put a poll over here would you like updates of project 300 would you like that to be every other month or every month? Let me know and I will see beautiful you in the next video. Bye loveys.